I have this new game. My new game absolutely rules. I seriously recommend everyone try my new game. It's called lying to people. It's really good. <laughs> Just lie to your friends for no reason. <laughs> like, like I told my friend, this is true, I told my friend that flamingos are actually blue, that because of the limited optical spectrum that the human eye can perceive, we see them as being pink, but they are in fact blue, and that flamingo is actually the Latin word for blue. <laughs> um, that's true. <laughs> I used to work in a toy shop, and um, I worked up in the bikes and stuff, because I'm tall and I can lift stuff. And there was a big punching bag, and this thing weighed about the same as I do. And I had trouble kicking this thing over, you know? And so a child came in, and I bet him a skateboard that he couldn't knock it over using only his face. <laughs> <laughs> the child was about 10 now. <laughs> it was really good. So I wasn't going to buy him this skateboard, but I wanted to see what would happen. <laughs> so the kid took about a 10 meter run up and just flayed him. The thing barely budged, <laughs> and he just skidded back along the floor. There's no punchline to this, it was just brilliant. <laughs> um, and when I was working in that same shop, there was a Polish dude working with me, and his name was Peter. And he, it was a Sunday, and he came in, and we were having our lunch, and he opened a sandwich, and he was about to bite into it. And I just kind of went, <gasps> Peter, no! Not on a Sunday. <laughs> I proceeded to tell this guy that it is illegal in Ireland to eat a sandwich on a Sunday because during the English occupation of Ireland, the Earl of Sandwich decreed that no Irish man should besmirch his name by eating a sandwich on a Sunday. And there were underground secret clubs where men would go to eat sandwiches on a Sunday. And that's where the phrase club sandwich came from. <laughs>